Hello, and welcome to the continuation of the storyline, Avengers vs X-Men. Let's continue this. While hovering over Wakanda, Neymar is directing a massive wave to inundate and destroy the city. Iron Man tries to persuade the Thunderer to block the gateway he built to access Kuanlun in the Avengers' lair, because of the threat Neymar would pose if he gained access to it. The Thunderer refuses when Stark asks him how much it costs to create the portal. Tony forces the Thunderer to enter the portal with him and shut it, sending every Avenger home once and for all. Before leaving, Iron Man gives Captain America the order to activate their covert weapon. As their city is being destroyed, the Wakandans are in danger. Black Panther vows to avenge this by killing Neymar. On the other hand, Captain America is certain that he could convince Neymar to back off and that he is carrying out Cyclops' orders, proving the Avengers correct. Black Panther, though, doesn't give a damn about right or wrong and requests that Cap gather the whole Avengers. As the scene shifts to Kuen Lun, where Wolverine and Hope are admiring the city, suddenly, Iron Man and the Thunderer arrive as the portal closes, Logan is informed by Tony about what changed their intentions, and Neymar appears. Back in Wakanda, Neymar tries to approach Captain America, but is halted by Iron Fist and slowed down by the latter's shield. Neymar repels Danny before T'Challa attacks him right away. After blasting him, T'Challa and Neymar both warn the Panther that they want to kill him. After Neymar compliments him on his supreme power, T'Challa informs him he was only trying to divert his attention. At that very moment, a group of 12 Avengers attack the ruler of Atlantis. He deploys an electromagnetic field to fend them off, but as soon as he cries out, Imperious Rex, the Avengers assault him viciously. After quickly recovering, Neymar goes on to burn the remaining Avengers after breaking Red Hulk's arm. Thor is on the verge of striking him with the Mjolnir at that precise time from above. At the same time, Cyclops is informed by Magneto in Utopia about Neymar's activities in Wakanda, and Scott quickly announces the departure of his squad for Wakanda. When Wakanda is retaken, Thor just hit Neymar with his hammer, and as soon as Captain America commands the Scarlet Witch to take immediate action, both begin hand-to-hand -hand combat. Despite the Phoenix's susceptibility to chaos magic, the Witch and Neymar began shooting each other. Finally, Wanda and Neymar both give in, albeit Neymar's appears to be more affected as the Phoenix Force strangely manifests. Finally vanquished, Neymar collapses to the ground. Spider-Man tries to celebrate their win, but Black Panther can only think about how his country has been partially destroyed. When the remaining Phoenix Five members show up, Neymar's share of the Phoenix energy is removed from him and given to the rest of his team, making them feel more powerful. When Captain America turns on a device in his glove, a doorway to Kuanlun is opened, allowing him and the Avengers to flee. Scott is then telepathically warned by Charles Xavier to desist or he will stop his actions. Finally reaching Kuanlun, the entire Avengers pause to consider the recent conflict. Captain America appears to be in a complete state of distress as he has no idea what to do when Hope asks what their plan's next move is. 